August 13th, 2019. So we're going to take a little picture of what environmental rape looks like. So these plums, look at this. It's already turning into a prune before it even got past the stage of being a green plum. See that one? It's still green. See how that is? Pup, pup! They should still be growing. Should have been a nice crop too, but what they did, because a lot of people, including me, love to come by here and pick plums and eat plums. So they came by, sprayed the fuck out of it. You can see how the grass down there goes from a nice color so it gets like faded and stuff. And so I think they probably, possibly, there's a likelihood from what I've seen and heard that they spray the fields to quick dry them at times when they're not supposed to. And definitely the creepy neighbor told me that they spray the garbanzos to quick dry them. So this is a, a little example of environmental rape that they did because they're doing starvation. And then, oh, there's the dude with the, oh, it's not, it's not an eagle, it's a skull. That was teal car, dude, hand delivery. So it's a skull, so, so technically he's one. I don't know what the fuck the deal is. Just because you're a one doesn't mean you're a good one. So yeah, this is environmental rape and it's a starvation game to make it so that we can't come down here and pick wild plums because there won't be any. See up there where the plums where you'd have to have a ladder to pick them, they're still completely green. See that? Completely green up there. The fruit is. You can even see up there. But then come down here, and you've got dead branches and weird batches of plums that are turning to prunes before they've even turned into real plums. Halfway ripe ones. That's green as shit, but it's halfway purple. But it hasn't even finished growing as a plum. So that's what I'm saying. That's the kind of bullshit that I that I think of when I think of farmers I think of this kind of raping and fucking with the environment for no reason doing chemical warfare on the local people to make sure that they have a good market frankly they want to be able to sell their fancy plums at the farmers market and make a lot of money coming up from Lewiston and selling stuff to people because they don't want us to be able to pick anything wild so they kill everything, and they kill our gardens, and that's why I kept getting on President Trump to uh, do garden protection and protect people that are growing food crops. Because when people come by and spray our crops and spray our wild foods like this, they're in effect killing and poisoning the American people. They're killing us. So, and that pisses me off, frankly, and I know the people that do it personally by name. We'll go down and we'll take a picture of their fucking grain sheds in just a minute.